Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Oracle Database Administration Workshop. Uh, so in our previous uh, videos, we have seen, uh, you know, creating our uh, Oracle Restart service, that is Oracle standalone uh, ASM server. Uh, you can see here, right, ASM is running here, and now we will create, uh, install Oracle Home and we'll create a database. So for that, you know, we have uh, softwares here. Uh, we'll unzip this particular Oracle binaries, unzip. V uh, eight three. This is the Oracle binaries. The moment unzip, I can see database folder will get created here. Okay, so the unzip is done. If I do lsfnltr, I can see database directory here. I'll go inside database directory and I'll do ll. Okay, so my binaries are uh, ready now. So if I do ps ef ps mon my ASM is ready here. So what I'll do, I will run uh, ASM configuration assistant to create a record group, right? So dot or INV plus ASM and ASMCA, ASM configuration assistant, that is ASMCA. It will launch this GUI. You can see, right? So now we will expand this, this group. Data is already available. So you just click on this right, left, right click, or you can create this click, create, and you can see record this group here. You can type uh, reco and go with the external redundancy and then select this disk and then click okay. That's it. So it'll create a record this group. You can see you are seeing data only here, right? In a minute, in a second, you will see the record this group. You can see data and record both. And data and record both already. You can just exit from here. Yes. Now we are good to start our database installation. So you have a run installer here. You can see run install. So run that run installer. Done. It will launch the GUI screen. Right. Your GUI screen is ready now. You can skip this one, next, yes. And you can create configure database, install database software only and upgrade existing database. Create by Oracle Home and configure database. Both I'll, I'll do it in one shot. And choose desktop class or server class. Go with the default desktop class. Okay. Oh, give me a second. Uh, it's your uh, Oracle base and it is your Oracle. Uh, uh, okay, I will change this one to my Oracle home. This is your Oracle base and this is your uh, location, data location. I'll go with the, uh, you know, this, this ASM, uh, uh, you know, uh, automatic storage management, right? So for that, Okay, it has to give that uh, the selection of uh, uh, this group location here, but some reason it is not giving, so not to, not an issue, but what we can do, so we'll go and we'll install database after only first, okay? And then we'll start the DBCA to uh, create our database. That's also one of the uh, best uh, solution, I can say. Uh, single instant database installation, I'll go with that. And then enterprise edition. And then this is Oracle Home, this is Base. And then, okay, uh, everything I'll go with the O install default. We'll do the pre checks. Uh, we are good, all this. I can ignore. Continue. Yes. And install. In a few minutes, it will be get installed. It is doing this prepare, it's done, and now it's doing a copying. It's actually copying it to the uh, the, the actual Oracle Home, user and app Oracle product 12.2 db one It is copying and it is extracting all the Oracle binaries to the actual Oracle Home. And then once it's copied done, it will do the relink, relinking of all libraries, binaries, executables, R manuscripts, everything it will it'll link, and then it will set up.
you can see right now it is started linking. You can see RDBM is executable and then RMAN executable, everything it will link here. Now you can see linking utilities, executables. Okay, RMAN utilities, everything it will link here. And then it will ask you to run that route script. Yeah, now you can see right, uh, it is doing a setup and it's saving the inventory. And in a second, it will prompt that uh, you know, root script. Okay, you can see right, you got that root script. Go back here, use your own app, Oracle product, told to DB home, root.sh. Just enter. You want TFA? It's left to you whether you want TFA or not. I'll go with this TFA. Okay, so TFA is done. So we'll go back. 